Pass up the Jeep, it's good to be free. Load up the pans and fishing poles. The highway is long, the wheels turning round. Pack up the cook stove and the bowls. Arlo and I, we hit the open road. Arlo and I are on the road. Hey everybody, well, my wife's not here today, so I want to make some sardines for breakfast again today. And today I'm just going to make a real simple recipe of sardines on toast uh, with tomato. This is going to be really good. Um, I have some nice, uh, pretty tomatoes here. And I'm, today I'm going to use uh, these uh, French sardines with an olive tapenade. So really, the few ingredients that I have to work with today, of course, have the sardines. I have a clove of garlic. Um, some beautiful tomatoes here. Um, some baguette. A little olive oil. Salt. Sugar. And some fresh ground pepper. But the first thing I'm going to do is a trick that we used to do um, in the restaurants to make our tomatoes taste even better. Um, I'm going to slice them up. I'm going to put them on this uh, baking rack here with a little bit of salt and a little bit of sugar. And I'm going to let those tomatoes sit for a while um, so that they can kind of weep out some of their moisture and really intensify those flavors. So we're going to do that. All right, so these tomatoes have been sitting for about an hour with the salt and sugar on them. And you can see how much actual uh, moisture or water came out of those tomatoes. So the flavor of these tomatoes um, is really intensified and it's going to be really delicious for our sandwich. So we put these aside and we're going to start getting the rest of our uh, ingredients together. So I'm going to take our baguette and I cut some nice at an angle, I'm going to cut some nice slices here. Just like that. And we're going to put uh, these in the toaster. And get those going. All right, so while our uh, bread is in the toaster, we'll get the rest of our ingredients going here. So we just want to get our garlic, and we'll peel that. Okay. All right, so I have my bread out of the toaster, and now we're just going to get the rest of our ingredients together. So we have our, our toasted bread, our tomatoes, which we have uh, been sitting for about an hour with the salt and sugar. Um, we have our sardines, some fresh garlic, some olive oil, and some salt and pepper. I also grabbed a little bit of fresh thyme to throw on there too. All right, so this is actually a really cool can. Uh, sardines a la tapenade. Sardines with black olive tapenade. Um, so let's open up these, see what they look like. Oh yeah, look at those. Those are some nice looking sardines. Okay, so the first thing, we'll set those aside. So the first thing we're gonna do with our bread is we're gonna put a little bit of olive oil on our bread here. And then you can either uh, take your garlic and rub it on here. That's one way to do it. Actually, that works pretty well. Or you can slice it and put little slices of garlic on there too, which I might do one of them that way. Put some 
few little slices of garlic for an extra little kick of garlic here. I'll put it on this one here. Okay. And then our tomatoes. I'm going to cut these in half. Like that. Okay. And we'll put our slice of tomato on the bread there. Make some room. Let's put these put these on here. Oh yeah. That looks great. And then remember we already salted our tomatoes so we don't need to add any additional salt for that but then some of our nice sardines here with the olive top nod it's like that and I'm gonna take a little bit of this top and nod and put that on here just like that And then to finish it off, I'm going to put a little bit of fresh thyme on top of each. And maybe another extra little drizzle of the olive oil on there. So there you go. Look how beautiful those are. So those... All right, there it is. Our sardine and tomato toast. Mm, nice little snack. For... Now, I used uh, French sardines uh, that were uh, canned with uh, olive tapenade, so that adds an extra dimension to these. So I can't wait to try these. There it is. All right, let's try this out. Now, first off, those French sardines are very nice. Um, they have that really um, light um, olive flavor to them and a nice olive oil on there. Um, they're actually uh, nice and firm. Um, sometimes when you have uh, sardines uh, with other ingredients in there, uh, they tend to work on the sardines and make them softer. But these uh, sardines are nice and firm and delicious. And they're really great complement uh, to the tomato and the garlic and the olive oil. Mm. <laughs> of course they're good, right? Mm. And nice and garlicky, which is the way I like it. Mm. Oh, they're really good. And the tomatoes, the intensity of the tomato flavor um, is heightened um, by sprinkling them with salt and sugar and letting them sit and um, let some of that that uh, extra moisture um, ooze out and it really intensifies the flavor of the tomato. So what a perfect little snack. <laughs> and now that summer is starting, um, we're gonna start to get some really nice tomatoes and these happen to be some really nice tomatoes, um, nice and ripe, which makes this whole dish. Um, if you don't have really nice ripe tomatoes, um, I would use something else. I would. Uh, Skip the tomatoes altogether, but with this, um, the tomato and the sardine are the you know the most important part of the show. So I highly recommend trying this recipe. Actually, it's not even a recipe; it's just tomatoes and bread and sardines. No, really, all it is. I'm just cramming these in my mouth. I'm not even talking. <laughs> but nothing really needs to be said. Um, they're super delicious and definitely worth a try. Um, if you like this video, please like, uh, please subscribe. That always helps us a lot. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Enjoy your sardines. Mm.